are back with some showdown. We haven't been on this for a very, very long time. Um, what I'm going to be doing is just playing some VGC on uh, showdown because I didn't know it was on showdown at one point because I looked through the list and I saw like doubles were available. But when I play doubles, it's OU and UU and they uh, they make you use your full team. So you have six Pokemon on your team, but you can use your whole team, not only four. So in the game, like in the actual console game of Pokemon, you only use four members of your six your six uh, four members of the team that you have which is normally a six-man team so you use four out of the six um so I made this team over here and I'm gonna try it in um, VGC I've actually been wanting to um do more VGC because it looks more fun in sword and shield um and these are wow these are quite common to see in VGC I don't know really too much about Togedemaru being in it Milotic, Tyranitar, Dragapult, Grimmsnarl, and Togekiss yes for Tokus lead, I would love to use Barrascuta more, but my Barrascuta actually has Swift Swim. I'm gonna change it to Propellatail and see how it does. I really want to use Propellatail with this team that I have here. So, um, I guess Grimmsnarl, maybe Dragapult lead or Grimmsnarl Tyranitar lead. Um, so in order to fight against this, maybe I lead with Roserade and. Yo, Roserade's a big target for the Togekiss, but I could lead Roserade, uh, I want to say Roserade Barrascuta. And then bring Pelipper in the back with... Mamoswine? No. Because Pangoro can come out and fight against a couple of them, but it's too slow, so I would use Hatterene. But I think I'm just gonna bring Mamoswine in the back. Hatterene I think would be really good against this team though. This is a... I fought a team similar to this, so I guess Togekiss might just... I don't see a follow me coming out for this. It might just go for an air stream on me. Do I outspeed? I do outspeed. So I could go for Sleep Powder on Togekiss actually. Praying I don't miss. And then I could go for like... Uh, a Mamoswine switch in on Barrascuta. Yeah, uh, because if it goes, for, if um, Togedemaru goes for like a Max Lightning, if it, I don't think it's on Dynamax, but if it goes for like a Zing Zap or something like that, I'll have Mammoth Wine there to take the hit. Uh, so it is going to Dynamax Togekiss. Fake me out, okay. I do hit the Sleep on Togekiss, which is really good. Um... I'm actually going to go for another Sleep Potter, because apparently that's legal in VGC, I think. I mean, it doesn't matter. Now I'm gonna I'm a sludge bomb the Togekiss and I'm just going to protect Mamoswine against the uh Togedomaru if it goes for like Iron Head or something. It's gonna nuzzle me? It nuzzle my Roserade to make me paralyzed. Okay, so Sludge Bomb is gonna connect. I think I'm just gonna be super Oh it's Oh, it's weakness posse. We're gonna be super aggressive to this Togekiss now, because it might be going for a max guard or something like that. Um I really wanna put Togedomaru to sleep to be honest, but I'm gonna Put all effort into knocking this Tokus out really fast. Um, Togedemaru could go for something like Gyro Ball or Iron Head. It seemed pretty fast. Togedemaru used Fake Out. That's the interesting thing in the beginning of this game. I have to remember that. Togedemaru gets Fake Out and Nuzzle it used. And it went before. It's pretty fast. 162 speed. Ball switch off. Um, Sludge Bomb didn't go off yet. So I'm praying I don't get Parod here. Nice. So we do take out uh, Tokus. Tokus is down. Uh, Grimstone is out. So that's two Pokemon out that we know. Three Pokemon we know now. Dragapult or Milotic. No, no, no. Tyranitar. I don't think you would bring Tyranitar if you used Weakness Policy Togekiss. It might be something like Milotic or Dragapult. That's the really interesting thing. Okay, yeah. So it's it's going to be Dragapult. And Dragapult does definitely outspeed both of us. It's one of the fastest Pokemon in this, uh, this generation. I just don't understand who you'd go for. Uh, Sleep Powder is probably annoying him. I kind of want to just... What would you go for? You, you could go for a Flame. You could go for like a lot of things here. I kind of want to just go for a Switch. No, there's no point in switching. Because, right, you can just... Who are you aiming for? I feel like you'd aim for Roserade. I'm going to protect with Roserade. And I'm going to just Ice Shard Dragapult. You could easily just... Okay, let's, what's he gonna go for? Refl 
select and flame door. Okay, so he is targeting Rose Reed, which is interesting because I would have thought he was. I would assume that he would go for a. Uh, uh, my man was fine, but okay. I'm gonna ice shard again. This should take the Dragapult out, and then I'm gonna aim for Grimstall with the uh, Sludge Bomb. Grimstall could sw actually swap out and take a uh, go into um Togedemaru. Oh, but he didn't, so Togedemaru is gonna be the last Pokemon he has. So Light Screen is gonna come out, and uh, that did way over way over half with uh, Rosary because Rosary is a beast. Oh my goodness. Um, and I'm just gonna Sludge Bomb the Grimstall slot, and then. Actually, I kind of want to protect and then go for Earthquake because this Togedemaru is unknown to me. So I'm going to go for protecting an Earthquake. I actually, I'm happy for, okay, Fake Out, yeah, and then you're going to go for what, Spray Break? Do you have Spray Break or, okay, you do have Spray Break. So I protected uh, Rose Raid. Not really too much of a crazy thing to see. Um, I'm going to switch into Pelipper and then go for Earthquake because I can avoid the Earthquake with Pelipper. Um, Iron Head, that's fine. I'm going to eat that. Earthquake is going to connect and that maybe will take Grimstall down a bit. Uh, that brings Togedemaru down stats, which is great for me. So I could just Ice Shard Togedemaru and then continue on this game. Okay, so my opponent gave up right there because that was it right there, yeah. Good game though. Um, I'm going to do another battle. I'm still getting used to this, so it's fun. Definitely a fun thing to do. Uh, I'll Creamy. Okay, I'll Creamy. Is interesting that's why i keep thinking so but this setup looks like a since i see a whimsicott whimsicott's very all of these pokemon except for like alcremy i don't see often in vgc i love seeing pokemon like that because i want to use alcremy more and one, it's one of my favorite uh new gen pokemon uh but whimsicott's definitely gonna be tailwinding and then i uh, wonder if it's a tailwind uh tailwind excadrill tailwind excadrill because you wouldn't but then you would have a scarf on excadrill maybe it's gonna be arcanine and yeah maybe it'll be an arcanine tailwind and then That'll be annoying. Um, so in this scenario, I might just bring Hatterene. Hatterene doesn't really fight most of these though. My weakness with my team right now is currently that I don't have a priority smack, like a priority fake out of smack, like smack at somebody in the beginning of the turn. But I could bring in Roserade. Um, as a lead. And then that extra drill is the issue. So maybe... Ooh, I kind of see something in my head that I want to go for. Uh, I want to go Hatterene. Mm, that sounds crazy. Back up, back up, back up. Roserade. Um, Roserade, Pelipper, Pangoro. No, 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 that's crazy. Roserade, Pelipper, Parascuta. Mamoswine? Because of Whimsicott Tokus? No, it's a Whimsicott Arcanine. I think I said that, right? That would be one of the leads? Yeah, because the fire is too good. That's why I didn't want to I didn't want to lead with um uh Roserade, but he's gonna definitely go for a if he goes for a tailwind protect, that's amazing. Cause he'll be able to tailwind and then protect his Arcanine from anything else. But I'm gonna protect the Roserade and actually go for a all out I could go for it my own tailwind actually. It's 161. You still would outspeed me. Wait. You would still outspeed me possibly with Arcanine. Definitely with Arcanine. I'm going to go for a Protect. Ooh, I could go for Protect Max Geyser on Arcanine. Actually, I actually really like that. <gasps> he Dynamax Arcanine. Wait, do you have an electric move or something? Tailwind, yep. Max Flare. Ooh, we're going to eat it, obviously, because of the wind. The oh, the exchange is great. Um, So the Protect went off. Um, But if it hits me again, we're going... Down, bruh. Um, will we though? Will we go down though? Because technically the rain's still up. I think I'm gonna go for a sludge bomb on Whimsicott and then go for Max. He can he can easily protect this and go for like uh because I didn't do that much damage, right? Sludge bomb, Whimsicott. Uh, Max Geyser, Arcanine, beat up. Oh, Justified Boost. So that means uh, Rosary is definitely dying, right? No. Justified goes up what? Physical attack or? Oh, it's yeah, it's a physical attacker. So it's gonna lightning me. Okay, that's fair. That's fair. That's fair. Uh, I'm gonna get this Max the uh the Sludge Bomb off. It's gonna be. Are you sashed? You're not even sashed. I think you just lived. <laughs> you just lived. Uh, 
I'm 360 speed. You don't have anything set up. 161 though. 161 times two, bro. I want to calc so badly. 162. That's no. You're definitely outspeeding me. Uh, dang. I, I could send in Barrascuta anyway. Um, how many times do we have for Tailwind? Both Tailwind lasts for two turns. Uh, we can go for protect now and just mitigate all damage. But he's going for physical moves. He should expect me to protect now and then go for... I'm going to stay open and actually go for a Sleep Pot or an Arcanine. It's crazy, I know, but I'm going to protect Barrascuta. He should be expecting me to... He didn't even expect me to go for Max uh, for our Protect again. Uh, that's interesting. I don't understand. All right, so we have Foe's Tailwind is lasting for one more turn, which is quite annoying. I can protect Mammal Swine or Ice Shard. I have Focus Sash, so I can live any one hit. Nobody else on the team has anything crazy. Uh, dang, man. But then Arcanine gets... I'm gonna Ice Shard Whimsicott, and then I already protected, right? Did I already protect? Giga Drain, blocked, yeah. Not gonna be able to hit me. He might go for Mammoth Swine. Uh, I'll live it, and then I can Waterfall. That's, hopefully everything goes like to, according to plan. Flare Blitz, we're gonna live. Don't, don't burn me with like the lower percent. Okay, cool, do you get knocked out? Cool. So it's three Pokemon down, I think, now? So we only have one more to fight. All right, let's see what we got here. That played out perfectly, but we could still lose. Togekiss. Oh, I don't, what did I think that I had? Why did I think I had three Pokemon knocked out? Togekiss is, see, right here. It, well, actually it's not that big of a deal. I was gonna say right here, I would love to have redirection, but it actually does not matter. Togekiss 141, uh, it probably is gonna outspeed me. I really wanna go for like a Icicle Crash on it. But I think I'm just going to protect. Eh, protecting doesn't matter. Protect, Go for protect doesn't matter here, I think. I can uh, try to flinch it with Waterfall. That's why I run it. Okay. Did we get a flinch on either? We didn't get a flinch with either of those hits. I think I just lose now because my look is Scout or Ice Beam. Okay, Ice Beam. Um, that's... I mean, he won, but that's really crazy. Like... Out of both moves, Icicle Crash and Waterfall did not flinch Togekiss. Um, granted, I I would have still... Oh, I would have actually kept um, Mammal Swine. Wow. Yeah, I would have kept Mammal Swine. Because Togekiss went after... Went after uh, just Roosted. And uh, my Lodic went after Ice Beam to... Um, uh, wait. Did it? No, it Dazzling Gleam. They hit both of us. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. So it's weird that it still got off its move. I think it had a berry. We're gonna go for one more. Um, that was a good fight though. I probably could have played that better. Probably brought better Pokemon. I thought I had it, you know, a little bit better organized, but yeah. So, Alright, so this team is a Tailwind team because I see Dragovish. Uh, Dragovish sometimes wears a scarf, but I don't think you'd be wearing a scarf in this scenario. Only for the fact that there's a Noivern there, and Noivern most likely will carry Tailwind. So if you lead Noivern, if you lead Noivern, Dra Dragovish, then yeah. And you got Duraludon, which is really scary. Uh... Arcanine again, so it could be Tailwind Arcanine again. Arcanine is really good, and I didn't have anything to back it up. I need a fake out. I need a fake out user or someone to like flinch at the beginning. Somebody to like stop something, some sort of setup. So what I kind of want to lead is with. Oh, this is gonna be kind of crazy, but I kind of want to lead um. Uh, I think we're gonna lead Ra Roserade. How do we fight you? Is a water dragon. I can lead a Roserade. Roserade and Hatterene. Because you have two options. And then I can bring. This is really a bad mashup, what I'm doing right now. But I can bring. Yeah, I can actually bring that. And then bring Pelipper. I want to bring Barrascuta for the. To beat out the. Uh, yeah, I'll bring Barrascuta. I want to beat out the, the Tailwind just in case. Also, Grimmsnarl, he's going to fake somebody out. Who are you aiming for is the question. Cause I can set up tail, tail. Uh, I can set up trick room. So you're gonna probably hit. Uh, you're probably gonna. Yeah, that makes more sense. You're probably gonna aim for. You probably aim for maybe um, Hatterene. But 
I'm a sleep powder to Noivern. I'm gonna go for that. And then I could swap out. So I mean everything is yelling trick room right now. I could have swapped out Tailwind. There we go. So I'm gonna put you to sleep now though. I missed. Wow, bro. Wow. I mean I could protect and then trick room. Unless this Grimstone is actually trying to is like a physical no, this is there's no way. There's no way. So you're gonna switch out. Everything on your team outspeeds me, so I except for Grimstone, I think. So Grimstone will be under the, the trick room effect. But if you switch, it doesn't make sense to switch out. Seeing me go for what? Your max airstream? Taunt, protect, nope. Who did you taunt? He ta he, why did he, wait a minute. Why did he taunt, why would he taunt that? That doesn't make any sense. Why would he taunt that? Granted, I'm not killing this max. Why would you taunt Roserade so I can't use protect later? That doesn't even make any sense. Protect was there for this, mo for a moment like this where you don't think I would have it. That's gone. Um, Tailwind has only one more turn, and you're faster than everybody. So if you send in Dragovish, that thing is gonna die. I hope Duraludon's not here. Oh, you're tricky. Oh, he did that so I could he can X out my my uh my sleeping powder. I think that's okay because I want to assume he's gonna go for. Mm, Arcanine's not going down to a Sludge Bomb. Definitely not. Uh, I can switch out into Pelipper to lower its fire type moves and then go for a Dazzling Gleam or Psychic. Or Dynamax my Hatterene and then go for a, a Max Mindstorm. But Max Mindstorm will create a... Uh, yeah, it'll stop me from using... Do I have any priority moves? I don't have any priority priority moves on me. Yo, we're going all out. My, Max Mindstorm on um, Arcanine. I'm also doing this just to get my uh, HP back. Like, uh, HP up just in case they're... Oh, you're gonna protect. I'm gonna break through though. You got hurt. Max, max airstream on Pelipper. Okay, cool. You're upping your stats, but we're still in trick room, so that's fine. I'm gonna just, I'm gonna scald here on Arcanine, and then that, that um, that the that the route's gonna say the route. That Noivern looks like it just wants to go for like protect again. To be completely honest, that's what I feel like it's gonna do. Uh, I got 30 seconds left. Oh no, I'm gonna scald Arcanine, and I'm gonna go for a. Max, my, max Starfall? I could max my, max Starfall on Noverin. Okay, so he was he was betting on me not going for that. So Skyld's gonna connect and down goes Arcanine? Lit. Okay, Hurricane's gonna knock me out. We have one more turn of Trick Room. Mr. Terrain is up, Trick Room. We're fine actually. If Dragovish comes through, we're gonna Oh, if Dragovish is here. Alright. Um we have one more turn of Trick Room. I actually wanna just leaf storm this thing. Granted, it could live, but yeah, I'm gonna. No, it can't live, Leaf Storm. That's... Yeah, that doesn't make sense. Whoa. Yo, we put all resources on Dragovish. Hold up, Max Starfall, just in case. And then just boom, Leaf Storm, doesn't matter. Okay, he count. I only won this game because he counted himself. He. he... I don't understand the first play where he faked out. No, no, he taunted. He shouldn't have taunted. Um. Rosary. I understand why, but I could just switch Rosary out. You should have taunted Hatterene in that moment because you just you just tailwinded. Maybe it was a misclick. I wish I could have asked him, but I think he misclicked. I'm gonna go for another game. I think he misclicked, but if he really meant to taunt Rosary, that's really interesting because you could have taunted Hatterene and stopped me from setting up Trick Room. That counted the entire team just now when he tailwinded. Anyway, we got another Dracovish. Um, I'm wondering how this thing is gonna move fast. It's most likely just gonna be Scarf. We have Vanillix. Maybe there's gonna be some um Auroraville action going on here. Uh, and Bisharp. Bisharp is really good for VG, uh, for just doubles in general. I don't know what kind of um, Gujar this will be. Maybe I don't know if you would mess with slowing uh, Gooey in this. Maybe Sap Sipper for Grass type. Ooh, we don't need Sap Sipper really right now. I mean, the Drago Wish you would want to protect, but still, that doesn't really make much sense. I think I should be careful because Hatterene's gonna be coming through. Do I need Hatterene for this? No, I gotta. I, I think I'll bring. Ooh, see, I don't like Grimmsnarl. Uh, Grimmsnarl, Arcanine. I don't like Grimmsnarl Arcanine lead, but I'm gonna bring Roserade. And I think Mammal Swine would be good to combat this. Uh, cause he'll have two choices. 
I'm gonna bring those two in the front and I can bring Pelipper in the back and then bring I'll bring Hatterene because even if he has Bisharp, I could handle Bisharp if he comes through right, right now. So he's going to bring, yeah, Grimstall. Okay. I have to find a way to deal with this better. But I'm going to protect because I'm... Oh, see, he's going to go for a fake out. A fake out on who? Mamoswine? Fake out Mamoswine, then just straight up just kill Mamoswine? But if I go for Sleep Powder, he'll fake out Roserade and probably knock her out. I could go for Protect Earthquake honestly or if i want to play it that hard and i think i'm gonna get faked out i could just dynamax um mammal swine and just earthquake um arcanine uh yeah i kind of want to do that to avoid that he's gonna dynamax arcanine as well for goodness sakes protect is he gonna hit roserade with that taunt that's fine i'm protecting again max flare on is it the same guy i don't know but i'm gonna max quake your arcanine it's gonna take that pretty well but we got a special defense up uh, I'm going to switch out into Pelipper, I think, because, uh, he's most likely going for it again. I don't know what kind of Arcanine this is. is it, it's probably special. It's probably special, and it's going to go for a, I think it's going to go for a Taunt again, I think, and I'm just going to go for a, I'm going to go for Max, uh, wait, Sludge Bomb on Grimstall, then Max Quake again on Arcanine. Max Flare, how much is this going to do? It's not targeting yo Sludge Bomb. That might just take you out. Can I have Poison? Did this take you out? He didn't He didn't put up a, a Light Screen, so that's good. It has a Citrus Berry. It goes down to Poison. Grimstall goes down to Poison, which is good. We got one more turn. I kind of want to just uh, Max Guard. Uh, but we have double Special Defense right now, which is really good. Um, I assume he would have Bisharp just because... Vanilla, so okay, so the so the so the Auroraville thing is probably real. Um, I kind of just want to go for a. Hmm. I kind of just want to go for a sleep powder on Vanilla, unless, yeah. He could change target and just target my Roserade right now, but I have special defenses up now, so I don't think it'll be that bad. Um, he's going for Mammal Swine, just non-stop. Okay, I'm gonna miss my Sleep Powder, which is unfortunate. It might just go for Blizzard misses both of us. No, that's so bad for him. Okay, so we're gonna just probably win this because of the miss. We have 2.5. We have three boost in Special Defense. They're not knocking out Roserade at all. Roserade eats up. Even if we're in the sun, Roserade eats up flame doors from. Yeah, he just forfeited. Like, I mean, I've had Roserade fight against Arcanine, especially the uh, offense of Arcanines, and they'll. Roserade will just eat it up. She does not care. <laughs> Alright, I guess we won that. So, if you guys enjoyed these battles, um, like, on the like button, like, and if you have any break and destroy, do whatever you want with it. Just don't hit the dislike button. It could make me really sad if you do. But with that, I think I'm out of here. Thank you guys so much for stopping by, and I'm really enjoying this VGC. Uh, if you guys are interested in VGC, uh and you have any suggestions um let me know let me know of suggestions for pokemon certain pokemon to use or uh teams so because i'm still new to this but with that i'm out bye